welcome back to Reaction Cast, where you can listen to us on Anchor, Google Podcasts, iTunes, Spotify, or any other podcasting platform, or now on YouTube. Don't forget to subscribe so you can keep in check with all your TV, anime, and movie thoughts and reactions. All right, let's talk about the HBO show Chernobyl. Chernobyl? Chernobyl. Why can't I say that? All right, let's talk about episode one. Uh, one twenty-three forty-five. All right, so honestly, the only reason I started watching this is because I was really bored tonight, or whenever you listen to this, like. I was like, I'm really exhausted, and this this has been a show that uh, has been kind of been on my uh, Twitter feed and uh, and everything. So like, okay, I'm gonna check it out. I you know I still have HBO. Uh, let's see what what this hubbub was about. Uh, so you know, I there's two episodes out, so I'm gonna do both reaction cast episodes, one of uh, each episode. So for my, I just finished watching episode one, and. So for the most part, you know, it's 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 a telling of what happened at Chernobyl. You know, for the most part, everyone has a brief idea of what Chernobyl was. It's one of the biggest like nuclear incidents that has ever happened in in history, um, and um, and you get to get to see it in these like mini stories. Um, so episode one just basically starts you off at the initial explosion. Actually, no. It surprisingly starts with the confession of I I can't remember off the top of my head at the moment. Um, but it's literally the confession of probably one of the heads, and he's giving away like you know all the secrets basically of what happened and everything, and it you know it's it's crazy um, because at the end he he kills himself because of what whatever he has done during the events of Chernobyl like they are very drastic because for the most part that event killed uh, like a lot of people and it left the the land devastated so episode one basically takes place during the the first few hours of the incident uh you get to see some people with horrible horrible radiation burns and you just see people just get radiation poisoning little by little it's crazy it's just literally the first few hours uh, you you get the tale of some of the some of the heads um, heads of the uh, fuck the nuclear plant and and then you get a tale of this like one firefighter of uh, this one nurse and then like kind of the heads and so for the most part you're like following these multiple stories at the moment and it's interesting because then you get a different perspective of what's happening. I, I really like stories like that when you sometimes it can get really um really clustered sometimes, but seeing these little life stories of these people because it it is an actual event, these people's lives happened. So getting to see individuals and seeing what they went through during these moments is crazy. Um so so it, it's 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 baffling you know you, you get to see the the firemen you know trying to put out the fire but it's just like it's literally like they're like near the near the radiation and they're slowly getting sick from radiation poisoning they just see like crowds of people just going to check out the this explosion you know <laughs> moths to a flames you just want to see the fire burn and you see start seeing the the radiation snow just falling and it just it's so sad th th knowing what's happening compared to being there like ash like ash falling down it's oh god it's so bad um and then you just kind of see these small just small snippets of these little t like moments of these like uh people who worked at the workers of the power plant and as they're like basically slowly dying and everything and then you got these heads denying everything, and it's oh my god, it's so like you can see the level of like work uh, that is happening. That these people are literally like enclosing themselves, caging themselves in because of the heads that they decided. And it's oh my god, it's so crazy knowing that uh, that you know some people are the ones that basically uh, these moments. It's like some people just don't want to accept their wrongdoings. Like it's not. It's like impossible. Like they can't do no wrong. Like oh my god, it's so 
it's done so well and it's sad sometimes to think about because it happened and things like that and like oh my god if there was a little bit more common sense here and there like oh my god an explosion could have happened nah it would never happen but could have oh god it's so crazy there's like these so many instances and it ends like with a whole like like just people around town just with radiation poisoning and this ominous cloud heading into the city in the early morning because it happened right around like so well 123 45 so one close to 130 the initial explosion happened and it's been about four or five hours and it's just now just with the winds heading into town it's just crazy because then you know you, you it's 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 home for people it's families kids friends family oh my god it's crazy and and basically the heads are just closing it off and it's oh my god it's uh i'm like it, it's it's sad to say that i'm looking forward to it because it is hard to watch but seeing these moments and times are really interesting to see how it's depicted um so I'm looking forward to seeing what's going to happen because, oh my god, it's, it's, I'm glad I just randomly decided to watch this. Um, so I'm going to watch episode two right now because those are the only two episodes out at the moment, but I'm hoping to look forward for more in this mini series, um, and see, well, we know how it ends, but seeing what, what the process was in these moments. So yeah, crazy. Oh. Oh, God. So, uh, you know, thanks again for listening. Until next time. Until next See time. See you. Until next See time. See you.